Hey guys, welcome to sunny St. Pete. Look at the weather, look at it. 78, sunny, not a cloud in the sky. Me and my buddy Jake here, we're gonna take you on a tour of St. Petersburg is what we're calling it, because we got the best food lined up. Jake, tell them what we got. Today on the menu for St. Petersburg, we got the one, the only, Bodega Cuban food on Central Avenue. The best Cuban sandwich east of the Mississippi. My favorite. Verified by Silvio, a fellow Cuban. Absolutely fantastic food. Uh, love it. Local. Next off on the menu today, we are going to Red Mesa Mercado. Best tacos, best bowls, margaritas, whatever you want. Chill environment. Gotta love it. And lastly, where are we going last? Last, we're going to Engine, Engine 9 for the all-American best burger. Knock your socks off, wash them, put the socks back on, and the wings. Everything knocks your socks off. Join us. Let's eat today. We got to go. Uh, I'm just going to have your incredible Cuban sandwich. All right. Um, and it, yeah, what's, what's the best juice, you think? Uh, the most popular one's the Kaylee Sunshine. Sunshine City. Sold. Yeah. Sold. Gotcha. Yeah. We'll do that. That sounds great. Thank you, my man. Look at it, guys. That's what we're here mm. for. Mm -mm -mm. Best Cuban sandwich in the city. And I can say that because I'm a Cuban myself. My abuela would be very upset with me if she knew that I love this Cuban a little bit more than her. So. I'm gonna go ahead and get in there. Oh, look at, look at Once the you layer. get a bite, look you get a bite. That. Look at that, guys. Look at that. That is the best Cuban in St. Pete. Cheers. Oh, come on, Cheers. man. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Oh my God. Mm. The flavor overdrive. Just... The marinade. Mm. Mojo marinade on the pork. So you got lime juice, lemon juice, orange juice, garlic. You can taste it. That's the best part. The flavors come through. These pickles, you look at these pickles. Those are not, those aren't your store shelf pickles. This is no Vlasic in a jar. Everything here is done with a touch of perfection. You can tell when food's made with love. This is love. This is what love, this is like your first kiss, you know, junior high. This is what that tastes like. And the line hasn't stopped since we've been here. I mean, this place is always slamming. So you can come out and support Bodega. Best Cuban in St. Pete, Tampa Bay. Hands down. Hands down. He's speechless. Look at him. Can't even. Okay. Not okay. at it's so, good. Nah. so good. It's so good. You got to feed the family. One you to know. ten. One to ten. It's 25. Wow. 25. 25. No. Feed the family. 25 is a little high. Not only are the Cubans phenomenal, we're tearing this up. I'm gonna finish that in a minute. But the juice is here, look at this. Fresh juice, pineapple, carrot, ginger, turmeric. This is the nectar of the gods. If you wanna live to see 150 years old, you gotta be here eating Cubans, drinking this at least three days a week. That's it. I feel the vitality. Mm, I can feel it too. Yeah. All right, guys, stop number two on our St. Petersburg tour. We're here at Red Mesa Mercado. That's how you say it, Mercado, okay? Um, one of the best little Mexican joints. You walk up window, get your food, sit down. No funny business. No mariachi band, no hostess, no server. Hey, where's my drink? Where's my beer? None of that. It's just you serve yourself. They got great drinks. You're going to see that. They got one of the best uh, margaritas I've ever had with Empress Gin. Who would have thought a little floater on top of Empress Gin? Service was great. The quality is going to be great. Yeah. Uh, it's one of the fan favorites here. Red Mesa Mercado. We got the Mercado Royale tequila margarita drink with fresh squeezed pineapple and actual pineapple lemon. Freshly squeezed. Let's give it a shot here. Wow, fruity, tangy, absolutely delicious. Good for you. Red Mesa Mercado, look at this, look at this splendid splendor I have. You have your chicken taco, beautiful. Pork tamale, look at this, I'll open that up for you. Oh, oh, it's like Christmas. Every time you come here, you gotta open it up. That's for me. 
you get your refried beans, you get your Spanish rice, and the cherry on top for me is always gonna be the beef empanada. Let's look at that, seasoned beef. You can see there's onions in there. It's incredible. Get a go, get in there. See that? This is, a, this is a move I've never seen anybody do, right? I've been coming here the last two and a half years. Nobody's doing this. Look at this, take this, dip it in the refried beans, right? Dip it in the refried beans, right? Then you come over to the Spanish rice. You see that cheese drip? You can't even pay for that, that's extra. Look at that, then the rice sticks to it, beautiful. I mean, come on, come on, who you kidding? Okay, get in here, you gotta get some of this. this little, we got a chicken taco topped with some diced tomato, sprinkled in with some cheese and lettuce. Try the Hard bean shell. trick, try the bean trick. Dip it, dip try it the in the bean beans. Okay. Going for the bean trick from now, the Cuban now, himself. Now it's use hard the to make it stick. Man. Yeah, you gotta make it stick. Use the beans as the glue. Sometimes less is more, and we're gonna go over the leek. Careful, salsa one, sauce here. Yes, there you go. See that crunch, dude? That's not Ortega. That's not Taco Bell. It's never been. Yeah, St. Pete. We support local here, so we're at the local businesses. That's what we do. Yeah, Applebee's, not for us. Olive Garden, what garden? I never seen a garden like that. Incredible. Yeah. Incredible. Mm. Yeah, chilies, chill out. We don't eat there. Mm. This is what you want. Oh. Oh. oh yeah. Oh yeah. Killer. That's oh my good. god! Look at this. Pork Get in tamale. Here, dude. Look at this. Seasoned pork tamale. So good. Steaming, piping hot. This is a sign that you're in the right place, right? When they hand you a bag and there's grease stains all on it, you know there's gonna be love inside. So, what do we got? Merry Christmas. Open her up. Look at that. Authentic churro. A little sweet. You had your salty, you know, you had your savory. Now you get a little, little churrito. Get a little dip of that caramel yeah. sauce. Look at this. Come in here, come in here. Get that, get that. That's poetry in motion. Just powdered sugar, nice and warm. It's got some crisp to it. Whoa. Oh. Holy <laughs> that's so good. <laughs> That's delicious. That is so good. It just melts. The sugar's a nice touch. Yeah, yeah. Powdered Let sugar. me get a bite of your Eat your own. <laughs> I got a double dip. Is that what dip, bro? Nothing I can do. There's no rules, man. Double dip it up. All right, guys, we're on to our next stop. We're going to Engine 9. Best burgers in the game. They win it almost every year. Tampa Bay, best burger. So, come get greasy with us. It's a little bit of a hike. We're gonna go up a block. Suit Resurrection, do you want curly, you got the curly fries? Oh yeah. Yeah, those bad boys are good. I love those. Uh, chef's, chef's recommendation, medium rare. Which is, oh, yeah. yeah, medium, medium rare is good. Between that. Thank you. You're the best. Your name was? Danielle. Danielle, thank you, Danielle. So here we got Three Daughters Beach Blonde Ale. I live three blocks from them. Fantastic brewery. Check them out. Sobio's got the Green, Green Bench. Bench Pilsner, I believe. Yep. It's got that light coloration, ice cold, fresh from the tap. Yeah. Phenomenal beers. I mean, plus you get check them out. You get great people like Danielle serving it up with a smile. What else you want? It's a spot yeah. after a nice. And this long, is a place day. you could come here. I mean, yes, it's a Chicago bar as you can see, but you know, right. you're in Bolts country. We got it all. We got it all. So go Bolts. You know, Stevie Stam. Uh, recently, we lost Tom Brady. Bucks. R.I.P. to a real one. But uh, the goat, greatest of all time. <laughs> <laughs> Still Champa that. Bay, the Rays are on the come up, the Rowdies under the radar, so it's a good time to live in St. Pete, Tampa Bay. So. Yeah. You want a sports game, you want to go to a nice place, get a beer, get a good burger, curly fries, tater tots, straight cut fries, sweet potato fries. People, variety is the spice of life, and they got variety, so what else do you want? What else do you want? Do you want little slices of apple, little apple fries for yourself? No, that's not here. Here you get grease and you'll like it. You'll love it. Another little gem about this place here is the wings. People don't, they, you know, they come here for the burger, but they don't know that the wings here are 
bar none. Nobody can do it better than I've measured in St. Petersburg. It's a uh, buffalo sriracha wing. And if that's not your take, you can get a crispy duck wing. What kind of bar you know has duck wings served gourmet? Stay tuned. That's, that's what we want. Look at that. Thank you. Um, this is a really spicy. Oh, this is. Yeah, that's the habanero. That's the really Ooh. spicy stuff. We gotta have it, right? You should try it. All right. But like, be careful. All right, okay. we'll be careful. Thank you. Look at that. You better watch. You can't even I'm drop this. Looking stuff. at that thing. Yeah. Let me see. That'll wake you up. All right, chop her up. All right. This is not your grandmother's burger by any means. I have to get you a pillow and a blanket after that one, my friend. <laughs> These people should be arrested. That's so good. Some, some bite. I'm scared of that sauce, though. Mm. A lot of good flavor. Great balance. Thank you so much guys for joining us on our St. Petersburg tour of beautiful St. Pete. Look at this beautiful place that we live. And we took you to some of the best food that we love every day. Great lunch spots, Mexican cuisine, Cuban cuisine, American cuisine. There's so much more. That's just a taste of what's here. Tell them what we got coming up, Jake. So next on the radar, we're looking at coffee shops. We have some of the best coffee shops in St. Pete. Dive bars, dog parks, Regular waterfront parks. We have the largest waterfront park in the USA. Fun fact. And uh, stay tuned. A lot more content coming. Like and subscribe at the Jack Smith Group, Facebook, Instagram. And uh, we'll catch you on the next one. Thanks for tuning in. Bye, guys. Much love.